This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you touch that like button, touch that subscribe button. Let's get right into the news. Oh, yeah, and don't forget to hit that bell. I hope you guys are doing well. Okay, so we got the baby. He's refuting that he ever touched that woman. And, uh, you know, of course, the woman is saying that um, she's a victim and all this. But uh, the, uh, the baby's attorney said that uh, the baby sh video shows uh, a person with a flashlight on their phone and the woman standing in front of her uh, contacting the victim. But they said they have yet to establish the real identity of the person who was the phone was uh, pushed out of their hand by the baby. But he was they he was struck by the phone. So I think he's a victim. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, that's what the video showed me. Uh, baby face uh, slights uh, R. Kelly on stage that's surprising because i don't know where but babyface was a little a little shade he gets up on stage he said if that was today you'd you'd get hooked up he added a little emotion if that had happened back then i'd be a whole different kind of songwriter uh don't you think uh he asked the crowd i mean i don't know i might write songs like r kelly or something fifth grade was the what would he say fifth grade that was the one could have changed my life i don't know if i'd ever be standing here today if that hadn't happened you know miss potter that's right my fifth grade teacher he began i had a thing for her but to be honest i kind of think she had a thing for me she gave him extra uh, i don't know i don't know where to see the shade though but supposedly he threw some shade <laughs> I, I whatever anyways uh then we got uh, Jackie Long, the actor that we know from what? What do we know him from? A-Town movie, or what is that movie called? There's a couple other movies he's in. He's funny, you know, he's, he's a good role to have in some movies. Uh, Jackie, Billboard Jackie everywhere. I think he has some new show out, and he's doing well. Uh, 50 Cent was boosting him up by saying he owes him money, and then Keisha Cole, this is the funny thing. Keisha Cole has a talk show. She doesn't even sing anymore. She has a talk show. And she's dating some guy that's like 20 years younger than her, too, I think. Which is fine, but it's like... It's just weird. Keisha Cole's on... It seems like she's lost, man. So, like, she's not a singer anymore. She has a talk show. The talk show is not that great. Not to be a hater or anything. It's just... It's not that interesting. I never thought as Keisha Cole was like a... Talk show host, but... We'll see how it works out. But anyways, she talks to Jackie Long about the 50 cent owing money. He's like, I don't owe him money, man. We're friends. Da, da, da. We have things coming. You know, I thought it would be more entertaining than it was. Then we got Kanye West, Havoc, uh, West Side Gun, all them out in uh, Wyoming. So obviously they're cooking up. Havoc, uh, that's, that's exciting. I like Havoc a lot, man. He's a good person. And he's very talented. This is George Tower with JT News. I uh, hope you guys are having a good day. I know that it's a little freaky seeing everything on the internet with like toilet paper is is all being bought and people are buying all the water and everything. I wouldn't worry about all that. You you still have tap water. Don't forget. Uh, and the toilet paper was weird to me. That that's the. That's the one thing people are really scared of, of not wiping down there. That's very weird, but, uh, you know, get some baby wipes or something, or get a cloth if you don't have any toilet paper, but, you know, get rice and beans and stuff like that, you know, because, like, it seems like, like for a week or two, things are really going to be kind of shut down a little bit. Like, they're still going to have grocery stores open and everything, but things are going to be kind of isolated so the vi they can contain this whole thing. So we'll see what happens. But it seems like China's kind of got it under control and other countries are getting it under control. And we're just trying to wrap it up really fast so we can get back to business. Uh, the stock market's fallen like good 30%, right? 20, 30%. Um, it's a little scary, but everything will get back to normal in about four to six weeks, I think. Like in six weeks, we'll start opening things back up, I think, like full, full operation. Then it will take another two months to like feel like everything's normal again. Uh, so like probably like right around summer starting, 
things will feel good again. I hope. But uh, that's that's just my theory. And plus, it's getting warm outside. It was like it's pretty warm out because I I live below. So I, I I was like 70 out today where I'm at. It was good. So anyways, uh, that 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 every uh, every flu cycle has you know right, right when the new season comes in comes in it goes away. Anyways, guys, write down everything you're thankful for. You have a lot to be thankful for, and be positive. Um, don't freak out. You know, be calm and you know just think about it. Like, make sure you got some tap water. Fill up bottles of water at your home. There's nothing wrong with the tap water. Okay, get some bottles. If you can't get bottled water, get bottles and fill them up. Be get some get. Uh, Get some soda and empty the soda out. You know, get, you know, whatever. (laughs) Peace.